This is a World Views interview with Barry Brailsford. We're here at Castle Hill in the South Island in New Zealand, and we're here in this amazingly beautiful place. Uh, it's an ancient site and a power place of this island, and as we'll see, one of the um, more powerful spots uh, in this area and possibly the world. Is how do I see the world today? And, and what's happening. But this is about each and every one of us. This is about the journey within. It's the time of decision for your life. It's the time for you to decide just how you live it and time to bring spirit back into the journey time of the head and the heart, and spirit is one. It's a time for honouring peoples of this planet as a family. It's time for honouring the needs of this planet and its nurture that we bring to you about that. And I believe that hope runs wild through many lands. fire of hope, a different kind of fire. It's calling out to so many people to make their journey within. So I believe there is a revolution taking place at this very moment, and one that can't be stopped by governments or war. It can't be controlled because it's in here. It has power that transcends all else. And when I look at people like the Dalai Lama who stand so tall and walk with such gentleness and compassion, speaking of compassion, the healing power of love, the power of forgiveness, the power of healing that comes from that, the fact that so many people are drawn to his cry for change, in a good way, then there is always hope. And when I look at the disasters that happen, the tragedies, the genocides, the blood spilt, the children that, that die every day, this brought about by the failure to forgive, this brought about by ancient hate, the need for revenge, commitment to a way that's old, desperate, obsolete, hideous in every way. When I see that, it simply reinforces the message that's been there for so long. It's been there in the spirit of Buddha the spirit of Christ, in the spirit of Martin Luther King and Gandhi, in the spirit of all of those who've held that torch high. It's about forgiveness, it's about love. So, I see this as a time of hope, despite the way the media present it as a time of darkness. I think they've lost their way. The revolution is within. People come to me and say, how can I save the rainforest? I say, well, firstly, heal yourself. If we all been, begin that journey, then it's going to happen. It's one by one. The power of one. So I don't despair of the things I see. It would be easy to fold up our tents and go home, to hide away in a cave and forget the world and let it get on with its problems. But now I, I see hope. I think that's important for all of us. We make the change. We can be the difference that makes the difference. We can be the world we want to see as Gandhi shared with us.